Man. Hello. It's March 20th. 7.08. And I'm irritated because I did an 11 minute video. And when I was saving it. Oh my god. I deleted it. So I have to say what I said to you. To you, you too. I have to say it over. But whatever. Dang, I, that's my second time doing that. So basically, why I do that is because when it's hot, when your text is highlighted like here, the shortcut is like Command Delete, and it deletes the whole thing. But for some reason, QuickTime Player, when I'm trying to rename my project I just created, it deletes a freaking video when you do that. When you do Command Delete, it's like so irritating. <sighs> Dang, I said so much too. <sighs> okay, whatever. Uh, that's a bummer. <laughs> Sucks. Okay, so last video I talked about. What did I talk about? Uh, sorry, I'm trying to remember. Oh yeah, um, engineer showcase is coming up. The job search was coming up, and I was relaxing. Um, I think those are the ma main things. So we'll start with the engineer showcase. It was fun, about two hours, and it, it was about two hours, and we met a lot of recruiters. I talked to about three people. Two gave me business cards, and one he said he was planning to send me a coding challenge, and then he sent me, or he took my resume, so he has my email. I have not received the coding challenge. <laughs> Excuse me. Kind of bummed out, but aside from that, what App Academy does or requires the students that are trying to get a job, it requires us to send 40 applicants. We have a quota. I probably explained this. 40 applications each week. I did my 40. and But the thing is, they're all, they're all cold applications. So what that means is I, I'm just applying online and I'm just sending my resume and I'm just gonna keep looking at myself let me turn this off there we go um wait can you guys even see me okay whatever but so what that means is we're talking about cold applications yeah cold applications those aren't really like the chance of you getting contacted isn't really as good as if you were to have if you were to apply somewhere that um you has a if you were to apply somewhere where somebody work or if you were to apply somewhere where a friend you know works there so a reference and so i had to do i did my 40 and now what do they have us doing the job search they have up to eight weeks they have like a day by day guide to keep us sharp or get better at coding while being able to like um apply and it's super cool super useful and it goes it's separated by coding um networking coding networking um oh yeah and working on projects and like one more thing but so all of those parts is cool there's one part that i don't like which is networking part and they require you to at least do one meetup a week and for those of you of you that don't know what a meetup is or what meetup is it's like uh, a site that provides events for people to, to network and we have to do one of those a week and as I, as I explained it um, before I don't really like that and it's not my specialty in my career before this in film I wish I networked more and like even in, more so in film you have to like that's all your career is, is like networking. Your skills don't mean anything, but that's like it was even worse in film. But so I was like never too uh, excited for that. Why? I should explain why. It just didn't feel organic. It felt like man, I'm just talking to people just to to get something out of them. Didn't feel natural. I only like talking to people. Because I'm like I genuinely want to get to know them, but yeah, that's what you gotta do though. That's what 
if you're hungry for something and you want to be successful in something, you can't just settle for average. You got to really be hungry. You got to go out there. And you got to get it. And uh, I'm, I'm trying to accept that. It's just, man, I can't just be like, oh, hey, what's up? And it's like awkward. It's like, what do we talk about? And another thing is I have to just, I want to, um, I'm afraid like I won't really know what, we're, what the person's talking about if I was to try to network with people. But that just ties in with me getting better as a developer. But aside from that, it's just networking in general. Networking in general is, <laughs> makes me feel awkward. Um yeah, so the engineer showcase, job search. Oh, yeah. So I guess that's our, that's the theme of this video. Like, whatever you do, whether it's tech, whether it's film, whatever career you're trying to, like, be successful in, you got you got to network. It doesn't matter what it is. You have to go out there and meet people that are in that industry. So if you ever want to get a job somewhere, and that person works in that company, you're already like a couple steps higher than everybody else, like doing cold applications. So that's my biggest tip. Network, network, network. Get used to it, even if you hate it. I hate it. But I'm going to try to get myself to go to one this week. And it's required, I think, once a week. Damn it. Um... So I did showcase engineer or engineer showcase. Um, what happens in the job search? What else? I gave you guys the my theme or my my tip of what to do. Oh yeah, my projects. I'm so mad to leave the video. Man, that sucks. Okay, so here's my JavaScript one, my video game. It's like cute little layup, or cute little website. Press enter to play, right? Voila, look at that. And the score on the top left, I, you can't pass the same branch. Then the, the score won't increase. Thought that was cool. And I used enter to be able to restart it. I just erased everything in my object or in my like game or in my code. Let's say like all of these branches are, are are arrays are in an array, right? If my character hits hits one of the branches, when I press enter, delete the array, make a new empty array, reset my bird's position, and reset the score, and it goes to zero. And yeah. But it took me a while to figure that out. I don't, I don't know why it's being slow right now. What the hell? Um, I don't know why it does that sometimes. But anyways, yeah. So there's still a few things I have to work on, but overall it's like solid. Um, what else? What I'm really proud of though is the Flex or Group Project, our Spotify project that I've been showing you guys. Look at that. There you go. Um, cool background, right? Has our links to our profiles. And back then it was just showing the songs, right? My partner found the API call to grab the actual song. A preview of it. This part's cool. Look at that. Let's see if it plays. Uh oh. Oh. It's weird. Because my Spotify is open, kind of messes it up. So let me see it again. See, and then it like reopens. That's, it only works, it's only been happening on my computer, but my partner's computer doesn't do that. Hey. Hey. Hey, hey, come on guys, hey, yeah, hey, 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 
it works. Um, the video I deleted. Uh, I was supposed to add. There's things I still need to work on. Obviously, like in my JavaScript one, the bird, the game, it gets like slow sometimes. I don't know why. <clears throat> so, like with this one, I need to add a demo user, and I need to be able to log out. And to do the demo user, we're still not sure how to implement that because, for one, we're using Spotify's like data, and we're using like their login, um, their login methods, or however they're doing it. So, if what I was thinking is. We'll have a login button, but like in the behind the scenes, what happens in that button is in our code, we'll have our username and our password that we've created, and we'll put those values in the Spotify login. But we have to grab the Spotify login page too. So maybe I just need to look into it more, but we're confused with that as well as the logout because, oh, that, that's why we're confused. It doesn't provide um, the Spotify API. It doesn't provide like a logout button. So we have to make it ourselves. We're just kind of confused on where to start. So for my JavaScript, probably look into why it gets slow sometimes. And for my Spotify, have the logout and have the demo user yeah oh, okay I think that's all I've got to say this video and let's hope I don't delete this again <laughs> so man that sucks but thanks for watching and I'll try to get a video out video out this week as well try to keep it more consistent because I'm not doing the the curriculum anymore and yeah See you guys next time.